it was, as you probably saw already, total festival weekend. And I ate like crazy. Um, there's a big difference because I did the same thing last year, but philosophically a totally different story last year from this year. I did a video on the Fantastic Five last year called Falling Down. Uh, and really the, the whole thing about that was the guilt I felt because I didn't plan to eat the way I ate. And the reason I have a total philosophical difference now is I knew this weekend was coming. And I knew I set aside um, this weekend to eat whatever the hell I wanted to. <laughs> God, it is hot, it's humid, I'm hungover, <laughs> I'm, I'm loaded to the brim with food from like yesterday, it feels like I'm going to be full for about a week, um, but in, in, probably ever since the summer challenge, really, uh, I haven't talked about what I've been doing since then, since it ended, and really what it's been is I've actually had activity that I need, that uh, I was either invited to do, or I instigated doing uh, over the last three weekends, so during the week I've been eating perfect, I've been uh, pretty low carb and then during the weekend I've kind of been eating without restriction you know if the food was out there I'd grab it I'd eat it I'd buy it I treat my friends to it uh, in fact I've spent probably about three hundred dollars over the last two weekends just on beverage and foods but then again some of that stuff I think. six dollars for a freaking beer ten dollars for a martini come on anyway <laughs> so um, had a blast and it's really time to start thinking about my future is because uh, I know between August in October, I'm going to put my body through hell and back. And I kind of actually have, I should show you the calendar I have, except it's on my work computer, uh, of kind of how I, I had mapped this out, which uh, since the summer challenge, each weekend I was going to eat poorly but perfect during the week. And then after this weekend, because this is when Summerfest is ending, I'm not going to do the festival things anymore. I'm actually going to kind of have myself this prepping my body month to kind of prep myself kind of slowly get myself used to what I'm about to do to it between um, August and October because as you know if you saw last year um, my goal is in for Halloween to be as buff as tan as hot as shallow as superficial yeah I know it's sad I don't care it's once a year but uh, it's almost like I, I'm going from off-season mode to season mode I'm like three weeks out uh, but but yeah I mean that's really the whole gist of that I, it's a challenge to myself and I'm recording it and I'm documenting it so you can see and I'm inviting anybody who wants to follow along to do it that's how it works with me I, I, I don't have prizes I don't do anything like that uh, I just hope that uh, I and I don't I know I say a lot and I talk a lot but I pride myself in I do what I say I don't back down from anything and uh, that's that's what I, I'm proud of and speaking of challenges there's a few out there that are starting right about now uh, that I did want to mention because I don't know if enough people have saw it and I've, I'm hoping to get the word out for them. Uh, firstly, uh, Jordan, who is another uh, Wisconsin native, even though he's in Illinois. I don't know why he's in Illinois now. But he's doing a Fit for Fall challenge, uh, which is 14 weeks long. Uh, I, I'll put his link in the information box, which is probably below my big head. And um, also, University of Me 101, that's Rhonda. She's doing a challenge. I'll put her information below. And then two big dudes, uh, Pascal 1973 and Cash Path, are doing monthly NGU Never Give Up challenges. So um, I'll put their information. And they actually have a channel for that. I'll put that channel underneath as well in the information box, which is down that way until they make the next YouTube enhancement. Every time I log on, I, don't, I can't even navigate anymore because everything changes every time. What's up with these people? Anyway, I'm talking way too much. Um, there's two more days left of this holiday weekend. What the heck am I talking to you for? I have yes, I have to go out and enjoy some of the weather, have some barbecue, have some more food. I'm not eating with, I'm eating without restriction. It's okay, isn't it? Isn't it? I don't know. 
I hope you're all doing well. We'll see you soon. What's going on, little bugger? Meow.